Hi, I'm Connor Tu with Customer Dynamics, and today I'd like to talk a little bit about bulk editing records. So as we can see, I'm on the Active Accounts view inside of Web CRM, um, and I have my accounts sorted here by the city field on the address. And what I'm finding is that there is a series of accounts here that don't appear to have a city on them. And I'm looking at uh, the main phone number, and there do appear to be phone numbers in here, but I happen to know that a few of these accounts certainly belong in Salt Lake City. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to check off a series of accounts. One, two, three, maybe we'll throw in this sample account too. And one of the options that pops up to the left is this edit button. So I'm going to go ahead and click on it. And with my four accounts selected, I have a form editor that appears. Um, and one of the fields that's on here just so happens to be the city. So I could type in Salt Lake City right here. As you can see, this is most of the fields that are on the account. I can also edit some of the fields that are in the header, like the revenue and the, and the number of employees or primary contacts, things like that. Um, a note I could not add in bulk to multiple records, um, but I could change in bulk um, whether someone was uh, um, willing to receive email or willing to receive regular mail or, or other items like that. So I put in my um, Salt Lake City address and I could click change. Now something that's important to understand with this is if there was information in that city field, like if, for example, if New Orleans was in that field, it would overwrite New Orleans with Salt Lake City. So it's very important to be careful with bulk editing and making sure that you're certain you want to make the change to all the records that have been selected. There is no undo. So I'm going to click change. And all four of my records will refresh and of course they've resorted but if I was to go find a few examples here's my sample it's showing a Salt Lake City here's my account name showing a Salt Lake City so a bunch of my records my four records have updated to show Salt Lake City so this is great now the great thing about this is this isn't just limited to accounts I could also do this on contacts and just about any other entity that has these check boxes next to it um, and the option of edit. There is a security preference that keeps you from doing bulk updating, so you can control that if you don't want um, certain high-risk users messing up your data inside of CRM. Um, but this is a great tool. I hope this quick tutorial about bulk updating or editing records inside of CRM has been helpful.